that makes sense for fans of old college. What's your view? I think, you know, it's interesting. Hollywood to me is very much the same as it was back then. It really is. The, 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 the actors are the same. There's actors that are wanting to make it. There's people like me that are working. There's the studios that are trying to make this. Um, except, the main difference is that, of course, in the 40s and 50s, that during the studio system, you worked for the studio. And everybody, including the actors, was an employee. So they were all over the place. You know, could be shot in Atlanta or wherever. When your next kid, it's up to you to kind of figure out how that's going to happen. So that's the main difference. But as far as how everybody interacts, I think I could go back in time and I would find that it's exactly the same as today. You know, I think my job. I have the same frustrations, the same problems, the same. And it's nice. I mean, there's this feeling sometimes that things are very different, but I, I, I'm not so sure. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, yeah. it's great. Yeah, 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 it is great. Okay. And last but not least, I know that we're going to talk about this. Surfing. Yeah, okay. Yeah, surfing. That was my last question. Okay. Uh, I you had surfed as a boy yeah. or as a teen. Uh -huh. uh, and you're coming back with that, I guess, soon. Uh -huh. How did you get uh, interested in that? Well, you know, I grew up at the beach in Newport Beach, Orange County. And I, um, it's so ironic. You know, back then, I had this ideal life. We lived on a beach. You know, we had to have a on the boat. And, uh, all I wanted to do was go to Hollywood. And yet everything was so great. You know? So now at 50, I'm having to go through a midlife crisis and I'm thinking, I'm kind of, you know, I've done the Hollywood thing and I, I'm anxious to re embrace my roots. And then, and not that I did a lot of surfing, I didn't, but I got up to people who did. And it was part of my whole life. So, um, and it's surprising to me, but I really look forward to getting back to that. Yeah, and I heard we were talking before about your surfing work. You're going to be. Putting JG on the. I'd like to. Yeah, yeah you like to? Yeah. yeah. I mean, why not? I mean, we're in a world where you can do whatever you want, and you know, we're, I think, our identities or whatever we want them to be. And there was a time when that would be really crazy. You know, what the hell? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I think that's so cool. Yeah, I did do it. And I'm yeah. glad you're wanting to do another comeback of that. Totally. Yeah. You're one of the rare ones that are a Judy Brown fan and a surgeon. Right. 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 But, you know, I was thinking about Midler, you know, who grew up in the state of Hawaii. But also was from New York, and if you look at that today, you can see that that Hawaii is wonderful in front of the persona. So it's a, you know, it's like that in a way. A little yeah. bit of a blend here, but it right. works. Yeah. Well, this has been great getting to know you, Tom. And I think it's a uh, great interview. Thank you very much for being my subject. You're welcome.